Oh, your kids ain't gonna be. I thought about it. You know, it young. But if you Gonzalez, what your kids ain't gonna be? Oh, it's a name. Why you smoking cigarettes? You just came out the church. They ain't teach you you ain't supposed to be smoking. See, will you buy a house, set it on fire, and move in? That's what you do with your temple. You destroying the inside of your temple, and you want God to dwell inside you? That's no good, brother. Bring you our up. brother. We are here to help our people. Um, now you're giving me secondhand smoke. Right. Oh, uh, what I saying is, um, Zebulon. Yeah, but we we are Israelites. We from the nation of Israel, from the tribe of Zebulon. I'm from the tribe of Judah. Some brothers from the tribe of Levi, Benjamin. Bring it up. And we've been given these names. Look, look, look at his name right here on our side. We've been given his name. Of, this is slave master gave us that name. The slave master gave us that name. You know what you've been missing, Dennis? You've been missing truth on your life. Give me that, and Hosea four one. Look what God say. But look what God say right here. Well, you too, sis. We've been lied to. We've been told that laws are done away with, and that's a lie. That's what our neighborhood and condition is. Bring right. it up. We do. We don't have God laws in us. We go and sing and clap and dance, but we don't hear the laws of God. Right. That's what's separating us from getting right with the heavenly Father. That's right. People say, "I pray to God." God don't hear their prayers. Right. And I'm gonna read that to you in a second. God is not nothing to play with. We take him as a joke. We try to think as he thinks. No, he gave us rules to live by. Well, if you buy uh, anything, a game, you buy a game. If you buy uh, um, a car, uh, not a car, yeah, a car. If you buy a phone, what come inside the box? Instructions. Right. You think God got you here without instructions? God gave us instructions that we got to live by while we're on this earth. That's right. You understand? We we at? Hosea chapter 4 and verse 1. Bring it up. Hear the word of the Lord, ye children of Israel. Uh, who? Ye children of Israel. That's what you're going to hear through the whole Bible. God is not for everybody. God is the God of Israel. Right. The God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Right. Jacob's name was turned to Israel. And now that's why we came to Israelites. Right. God is not for everybody. I'm right. going to prove it to you in the Bible. This book been here all our life. But you know what? We haven't been reading. Remember when we read earlier, you wasn't here, but we went to Revelation 1 and 3. He said, blessed is the man that readeth. Right. If you read, nobody can take that from you because you see it yourself. You know what God's saying yourself. But read where you at. For the Lord had the controversy with the inhabitants of the land because there is no truth. Because what? Because there is no truth. Read it from the topic. I want y'all to hear this clearly. Hear the word of the Lord. He said you got to hear the word of the Lord. Ye children of Israel. He said hear the singing, hear the clapping, hear the dancing, the gyrating, right. the sweating, the lying. He said, hear the word of the Lord. How are you going to hear the word of the Lord? Huh? Just listen? You think just listening? Read it. Read it. That's how you got, come on, you got it now. You got to read. That's how you're going to hear the word of the Lord. He said, hear the word of the Lord. Ye children of Israel. He, that's all he's talking to the Israelites. God is not for everybody. Read. For the Lord has a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. Because there is no truth. There's no truth in this land. There's lies being told. Dude. They said God laws are done away with. But I ask people, all right, if God laws are done away with, can we write? They said no. no. Can you be a homosexual? No. So what, what laws are done away with? You understand the confusion? These churches have been lying to a long time. Right. And these old men have not been standing up for their people. These older women have not been standing up for their people. Bring it Why out. do you think you got so many gangs out here, drug dealers? Kill us. Why do you think you got so many pimps and hoes out here? Because people haven't been teaching the younger people how to live. That's right. right. You understand? According to God. Read. Read. Because there is no truth. Because there is no truth. Nor mercy. Nor mercy. Because uh, people out here killing people, robbing people. They don't care. In that neighborhood, when you go to the ATM, who are you watching out for? Because you say you got a card all the time. When you go to the ATM, who are you looking at your shoulder for? Huh? What, what, how the robbers look? Like who? Like us. Right. Like us. You ain't worried about no Chinese coming to rob you. Bring it up. You ain't worried about no Arab coming to stick you up. Right. Sitting here with a turban on his head. You worried about the blacks and Latinos, the Israelites. That's what you worried about coming Please. to get you. That's what God talking about right here. Read that again. There is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God. There's no knowledge of God. Why? Because you don't know you as an Israelite. You ain't know you was an Israelite. You ain't know you was an Israelite. There's no knowledge. 
of God no more. These people, get, they, say, they act like they serving God. They're not serving God. They're not serving God. If you want to serve God, you have to keep God's commandments. You have to keep his laws if you want to serve him. Right. If you want to serve your king, how do you serve your king? Follow, Follow everything he asks you to do. He is the king. He is the, thank you. That's so right. Christ is our king. And That's he gave right. us instructions to live by. That's right. Read. Your knowledge of God in the land by swearing and lying. By swearing and lying. And killing. Uh -huh. and, and what? And killing. And killing. And stealing. And killing ain't just putting a gun to you, shooting you. Killing is not taking away the word from you. Right. You understand? Right. Killing is me taking the word away from you. You understand? Right. Not giving you the understanding of who you are. I'm killing your soul like that. We gonna, he just reading it orally in Ezekiel. You understand? That's how we kill people by taking the word away from you. They say everything gonna be all right, just call on the name of the Lord. You think God that simple? You could do all this evil and just call on his name and he gonna just uh, get you out of your condition? Sure. No, you gotta work. You gotta work to get the kingdom of heaven. Oh, yeah, hold that. Hold that. Give me uh, Luke 17 and 20. Luke 17 and 20. Bring it I'm up. I'll show you you got to work to get to the kingdom of heaven. Bring it up. It ain't going to be easy. Christ had to hang on the cross for us. Bring Christ had got his beard ripped out. The black Messiah, he died like a black man. You understand? Read. Read. Luke chapter 17 and verse 20. Bring it up. And when he was demanded of the Pharisees, uh -huh. when the kingdom of God should come. So he was asking, when the kingdom of God going to come? He answered them and said, uh -huh. the kingdom of God cometh not with observation. Christ said the kingdom of God is not coming with just hearing. You know what you said hearing earlier? It's not coming by just hearing. You got to do something. Read. The kingdom of God cometh not with observation. Neither shall they say, lo here. They can't say he coming from this way. Or lo there. Or he coming from that way. For behold, the kingdom of God is within you. The kingdom of God is within you. Hmm. While you reading the Bible, while you studying the Bible, not while you singing, clapping and dancing and playing games. This ain't no time to be playing games. Hmm. Playing church. You got to live this. You got to live this Bible. Right. You can't just play church. You got to live this Bible. That's right. Go back. Give me uh, Hosea, uh, Hosea 4 and 6. Hosea chapter 4 and verse 6. I see so many women coming out the church with pants on. And God said, women not supposed to wear pants. Right. Men not supposed to wear a dress. Right. Men supposed to have beards on their face. Right. God was not that way. And let me tell you a secret. When Christ walked the earth, when Paul walked the earth, when the disciples walked the earth, it wasn't no New Testament. Right. They was living the New Testament. It wasn't no New Testament written. So everything Christ spoke of, everything Paul spoke of, came out the Old Testament. Right. Right. You gotta stop playing games with God. You understand? Read that. Hosea chapter 4 and verse 6. My people are who? My people. God got a special people and that's the Israelites. That's you blacks and Hispanics. Y'all are the Israelites. He said my people. Are them your shoes? Are those your shoes? Oh, they, is that your shirt? Is that your dress? God said, my, this is a possessive word. He belonged to him. Right. This is God's people. Read it again. My people. He said, my people. Are destroyed. Are what? Are destroyed. Are we not a destroyed people? Are we not a destroyed people? Bring it out. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. He said, my people are destroyed. For lack of knowledge. Because they don't know who they are. We destroyed because we've been taken away from who we are. And we've been assimilated with America. Let me give you an example. Give me that in uh, Revelation 18 and 4. We've been celebrating what here? Yeah, give me a uh, in three, uh, 3 and 8 as well. What we've been celebrating here? What's the day, so-called? Uh, June 19th. June 19th? What is it? It's supposed to be Father's Day, right? Yeah. You celebrate it? <laughs> you celebrate it? Yeah, you celebrate it? Thank you. You ain't supposed to celebrate it because that's not a God. Right. Let me give you another, uh, another reason why not. They say today is Father Day. Every day you're supposed to honor your father and mother. Right. Right. Not no one day. Right. America tell you today is Father Day. And that's a lie. And that people believe it. Right. We've been believing lies all our life. And however old you are, you've been believing that lie all these times. Right. They say certain day is Father Day. Certain day is Mother Day. Right. Certain day is Christmas. 
Christ was born on that day. That's a lie. Christ was not born on December 25th. You can't read it nowhere in the Bible. Jeez. So why are we keeping these things? Why are we following them doctrines and lies? Because we've been programmed to assimilate here in America. We've been programmed because why? They've been beaten into us, whipped into us. Right. You understand? Know we believe it or not, you might say, well, I ain't come over here in slavery. No, you didn't. But you know what? They drug y'all behind back to Europe. Right. Back to Spain. You know, you should not, you should stop going to church. You know why? We are the church. This is the church right here. We're right. here where it's going to church. Right. Church ain't about Satan. Let me get that in Acts 7, 49, 48. God said he do not dwell in a uh, building made by hand. God is not in that building. I didn't run that building but lies. Tithes is not in the Bible as money. Tithes is not money. Tithes is not 10%. Right. What we getting all these lies from? I, people love to hear lies. I'm going to read that to you too. Read. The book of Acts, chapter 7 and verse 48. I'm going to show you God not in that damn building. How be it? There should be no homosexuals in that building. There should be no homosexuals. God said he hate that thing. Read. How be it? The Most High dwell is not in temples. The Most High is the God of all things. He do not dwell in temples. Made with hands. He don't dwell in temples made with hands. That's why they don't come to the streets and teach their people. They can't. They can't because they don't know the Bible. Mm. That's why we're here to bring the truth back to our people. You blacks and Latinos, you are the Israelites. Oh, you God. women got to come out of wearing pants. They got to get back in your dresses. The men, they got to grow some hair in your head right. and grow a beard in your face. Mm. Two people are have beards on this earth. Women and children. Grown men for to have beards on their face. Thus saith the Lord. Right. It's the Lord that's in the Bible. <laughs> I just if said you I might have did it in there. You know what I just said? If I was born you know with a picture said? with no hair, would that but mean you know that I, I don't love God? But you wasn't. Yo, I don't love God. Don't, don't say if so you. Don't tell you know what if means? But you know what if means? You know what if means? That's ridiculous. If is conditional. God you don't have alopecia. You don't have alopecia. God is in your spirit. Read that again. Read that again. Read that again. Read that for that man. Read that for our men. God you know what? An angel won't come behind you and check you by hand. They God shall God not no make. They God shall God not God make boldness. God said you should not make boldness. God upon is their in hell. your spirit. You think he's asking us? You think God asking us what to do? Yeah. Or you think God Take instructing us what to do? And all that. I'm asking you a question. Yeah. You think God asking us, or you think He instructing us? He's commanding us. He don't care what man thinks. He don't, don't care what man thinks. Think. Think. I don't, don't care what man thinks. God is in my they shall not, I'm going to show you what God said. They shall not they make boldness upon their head. Your mouth don't mean nothing. Your mouth don't mean nothing. He said they honor him with their lips. I just read that a second ago about people honoring him with their lips, but their mind is far from him. His mind is far from God. He honor with it. Oh, God. But he don't do nothing God say do. Right. Is that right? Read that. Is that right? That's all I right. serve others. Neither I people shall they save all the others corner of their beard. He but said, neither God. shall we shave off the oh, corner of our beard. Some people oh, got a good God. job. You might got to have a five o'clock oh, shadow. But you got to let their beard grow. Christ had a beard. Christ's beard got ripped off by the Israelites. Bring it up. And that's you, 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 you. Christ got his beard ripped off his face for us. Christ got hung on the cross for his people. You understand? If you love God, you show it by your action, not by your mouth. Right. By your exactly. action, not by your mouth. Exactly. You got a bald head. Read that again for his bald head. They I shall not make I feel that don't mean nothing. Don't mean nothing to me. I you think that's me? Loud talking don't mean nothing to me. See, but Read. you loud talking. They shall not make boldness upon their head. This is what God telling us. He said, shall not. Read that again. God is not asking us. Read that again. They shall not make boldness upon their head. This is what God telling us. He said, shall not. God is not asking. God said, they shall not. That's you loud talking. 21 and 5. 
A little bit. It's 21 and 5. Yeah. Read that again for him. You loud. They shall but not make money. You emotional. The no. church got you emotional. No, you. The church got you real emotional, you. brother. First of all, maybe you're not stable enough to be right in there. there. But maybe you're not stable right enough there to be there. To they shall you not let boldness when somebody upon else speak their head. That don't bother me. That don't bother me, brother. When other people brother, speak up, don't want to hear. That don't bother me. You I don't care about that. But you don't want to hear. They shall not. It should be between you and God. We delivered the message to you. We delivered the message to you. Give me that in Ezekiel 2. Bring it out. Y'all ain't out here doing two, nothing for nobody. You're not helping you people. So. You're you don't know. People. You don't know. You're Look not us up. Look us up and see what we do. Look us up and see what man. we do. Jeez. We over the four corners of the earth doing all the work. Ezekiel chapter no, 2 and verse 3. I don't see you in the street teaching nobody. Bring it up. And he said unto me, Son no of man, I send thee you to the no children of Israel. God said he sent us out here to the children of Israel. Go ahead. To a rebellious nation. To who? A rebellious nation. God said the Israelites are rebellious. He said, I'll send you to a rebellious nation. Right. That has rebelled against me. He ain't rebelling against me. I don't care if he's mad or not. He rebelling against the heavenly father. Mad. And their fathers have transgressed the against Us me. and our fathers transgressed against the heavenly father. You know what I'm saying? That's what we did. We transgressed against the heavenly father, brother. You transgressing against the heavenly father. Right. You like it or not. You breaking God's law. Right. Read. Even unto this very day. Even to when? This very day. Even to this very day. God said, you shall not make boldness of your head right. or shave off your beard. Right. Oh, well. He said, shall not. Oh, well. He ain't asking us. Oh, he ain't well. telling us. Read. Excuse me. Verse 4. For they are yeah. stiff-hearted. They stiff-hearted. He is the perfect example of what God told him about. Read. I do say this, our brother. We still love him. We ain't gonna give up on them. No, Only thing we can do is deliver the word. Right. Don't hate the messenger. You understand? Don't hate the messengers. We just delivering a message. Don't hate us because we delivering a message no, of no God. Hate, no hate. No I hate. I do send no thee hate. unto no them, hate. and no thou hate. shalt say unto them, Thus saith the Lord God. What are we doing right here talking to y'all? We saying, Thus saith the Lord God. That's what we saying. That's the way I was learned. All right. God has all right, all praise you, brother. Appreciate you. Or my clothes, yeah, uh, or what I have, or what I possess. Yes, sir. God has nothing to do with none of that. He got everything. He didn't wake you up this morning. I said. Did he wake you up this morning? You missed it because you was talking no, about God. No, I heard what you said. That. Again, I, I say this. I feel God is not in my hair, in my clothes, or what I possess. Why God not? is in my spirit. What he said. And if I wake up with nothing every uh -huh. day, but I wake up and I say, you know what? Thank you, God. I'm going to go out here and live life. You think you're in your prayers? 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 And I got one You left. think he's hearing your prayers? You think every time we pray God hear us? I know he is because he keeps waking me oh, up. Are we, we gonna That's the blessing. Satan might be waking you up. Yeah. Bring it up. Satan might be waking up. Satan yeah. got power on this earth. I'm, you don't believe Satan got power? Boy. I'm going over the same thing with you two guys. God said you got to have him in your head. Yeah, you My head going ball in the middle. And you gotta have a mustache. What Who don't have do? beards in this earth? So what are you gonna do when what two people don't have that what two top? people don't have beards on this earth? What two people don't have beards on this earth? Kids and women. Right. He so give you what? a beard to so wear a beard. What? So now what are you saying? I say Are you insinuating that I'm affiliated with some type of homosexuality or feminine? Did I say that? Huh? Did I say okay, that? Then, that's what I'm what saying. I said. I that's said women. I ain't taking back what I said. That's women what and kids okay. don't have beards on their face. That's man. why you supposed to have a beard. Oh, Bring it out, man. man. You supposed to have man. a beard. Man. 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 You really that grown man? You supposed to have a beard. Man. Man. You supposed to have a beard. Give me the Bible dictionary. Give me the Bible. Beard do make you a man. Beard do make you a man. Fuck. If you think so, if you think so, whatever, then it won't prove it. Bible we dictionary. Go to prove yeah. what? I, I mean, ain't gonna you prove mean? to you, bro. I'm gonna prove what God is true. I'm gonna prove Christ is black. I'm gonna prove, prove that you are Israel. I know Christ is black. I know Christ is black. You can't tell me he's black. Let's read beard. Let's read what beard means. The Zondervan Bible Dictionary. A badge of moral dignity. What do you say beard is? A beard. A badge of manly dignity. What God said a beard is? What God said a beard is? Is a badge of manly dignity. Yeah, that's right. Read more, please. Beard. 
A badge of manly dignity. Boy, you are doing to make you a man? Yes! A man make you a man. A man make you a man. Because God gave it to you. Not he separated women not from a man. If right. I go to the jungle right now, how can I tell a male man from a female man? Bring it out! The man! Is that simple? Right. Who are we making it hard you for? He gave males well. Mange, bitch! That's what God gave them. Right. We ain't so mad about it. What's wrong with this guy? Because you falsifying the word. Right. You using the, the word. The Israelites were fast. forbidden to shave off the corners fast. of their beard. Bring it you see what God said? You are using the you word. See word God said? Bring it you see what God said? You see what God said? Read that again. In a false the fast. Israelites were forbidden You're to using. shave off the corners and of their beard. Right. You are Israelite. No. You are Israelite. No. You don't know this right here. I'm a Judah. You are American blacks. You are Israelite. It was no America when Judah was land. Negro was no America. What you see at the bottom? It says Judah, American blacks. There was no America. With that time, there was no America. What they call black people? What they call black people in slavery? What they call black people? In slavery, what they call us? Did they call us American? African American? No. What they call us? American blacks. There was no America. There was no America at that time. What is that for sale? So how did you do that? Negroes. 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 That means black. That means black. We came from Israel. We came from Israel. Negroes is king. That means black. That means you have. No. Negroes is Ethiopian. Hey, King. Let me, you ain't Ethiopian. What the hell are you worried about this for? You're not Ethiopian. Hey, 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 hey. See, I'm you're separating with you. the I'm blacks. tired of playing with you you're now. Hey, hey, blacks. Listen. You're a divisive listen, servant. Listen, brother. Hey, sisters, yeah, brother. You know what? God is talking about our people you being rebellious. Give me uh, Roman 3. No, no. I want you to hear this before you run away. I've been listening all I want you to hear now. this. And you ain't changed yet? You been listening? You ain't changed yet? You ain't changed yet? You been listening? You haven't been listening? What? Read. Romans. You haven't been listening? If you listening, you would have changed by now. Romans chapter 3 and verse 1. What do you do? Look what God said about us, y'all. What advantage then has the Jew? God said, what advantage has the Jew? He took on to the Israelites. What advantage we have? Or what profit is there of circumcision? What profit is there of you being Israelites? Men getting their things circumcised. You know what profit is in that? Much every way. We said? Much every way. He said much in every way. Is that advantage of you being an Israelite? You being over everybody else. That's why we went in slavery because we rebelled against God. You see right. how he acting? That's why we in the condition we in now. Right. Our people is not going out there. He not, why he ain't yelling at the drug dealer? Bring it out. Why he ain't yelling at the pimp that's pimping the girl out there? Dude. Bring it out. Why he ain't uh, uh, yelling at the gangbangers who killing each other over colors? Right. right. He yelling at God because he got a bald head. Bring I, it you, out. You can't make this stuff up. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.